Hi guys, I'm Kristen. You're watching Kay's Perfect Fitness TV. So today I have a slim and sexy thigh workout for you. And what's so great about it is we're really just going to focus in on those inner and outer thighs. Alright guys, so I have five amazing moves for slim and sexy thighs. So if you want to grab a mat, some ankle weights if you have them, or maybe some heavy tennis shoes, that would be great. Um, also, another thing that if you do have a Pilates circle, go grab that. You might want to use that for our first exercise in working those inner thighs. If you don't have one of these, that's fine. You can just, just do knee taps. Or if you have a small playground ball with just like, you know, just a little bit of air missing out of it, that will work too. Okay? So, if you start by lying on your back. Okay? And what we're going to do is a shoulder bridge. So, if if you press your heels through the floor, you just pick those hips up, and then if you don't have any props, you just squeeze those knees together. One, two, three. Really engaging through those inner thighs, resisting that, and then placing your hips back down. Or if you had a ball, then the ball would be just in between your knees, and you lift up and just squeeze the ball. Three, two, one. Lower down. If you have that potty circle, I'll just do the rest of it here with the potty circle. We lift up and exhale, squeeze. <sighs> And then put the hips back down. So this is four. And lower. Five. And lower. Six. And lower. Seven. And lower. Eight. And lower. Nine. And lower. Ten. Lower and release. Okay, so we have ten reps. Of the shoulder bridge onto your side the top hip bend that leg place it behind the other one lift the bottom leg up and down 20 reps two three four five six really engage in the inner thigh nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen 18, 19, 20. Awesome. Quickly change it over. Okay, so bend that top leg and flex the other foot. Like I said, if you didn't have those ankle weights, put some heavier shoes on. Got some Doc Martens, those are heavy. Put those on, that will work. <laughs> Be creative in your workouts if you're working out at home. You don't always have to have everything. Make this workout work for you, whatever you have, okay? Let's say that's 12. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. Good. Relax that down. I want you to lie all the way down your side. Make sure your back is nice and straight with the back of the mat. And then bend both of your legs so they're making an L shape from your hip, okay? Then just lift that top leg up and down, keeping it in parallel. 10 reps here. This is four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. We're gonna keep going. Just turn that toe down, heel up. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, my favorite, we're gonna paint some rainbows. So your toe is down, and then you bring your heel down where your leg would be straight. So here we go. Two. Three, four, five. Make sure you're really rotating that leg. Six, seven, eight, nine. Last one is ten. Good job. Let's change it over to the other side. You should be starting to really feel those outer thighs working on there. And legs forward at your hips, okay? And lift that top leg up and down. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Keep going. Just turn that toe down, heel up. One, two, three. Really invert that leg. Four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. 
paint those rainbows. Toe down and heel down. Good. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Last one. Ten. All right, good job. Good, just give your legs a little shake and you want to repeat this two more times. So, um, yeah, just make sure you do this two more times for the best, best result to get those inner and outer thighs looking slim and sexy. So if you don't have any ankle weights, invest in a pair. Mine are one and a half pounds each. So um, that gives you a guideline. Um, you can go anywhere kind of between that, between that range, okay? If you are gonna go shopping and get some. And, um, I hope you've enjoyed the workout. If you haven't already, make sure you find me on Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, Instagram. I think that's about it. Anything that you can be friends with me, I will be friends with you, okay? So make sure you join in the Case community and check out my website. And we've got a lot of fun things happening on there too. So um, thanks for watching. I'm Kristen, you're watching Case Perfect Fitness TV.